Dear diary, it's now Friday, eight and forty-four a.m. and、um, it's pretty much like twelve degrees outside. Literally, my family wants to get to our relative's house, aka my grandma's house. And what's even worse is that I wasn't able to sleep at all. Like I literally woke up at like five or six thirty a.m. I literally have spent the whole morning like that with no goddamn sleep, which is a real complete bullshit. And all of that, literally me putting flashbacks and best case scenarios inside my goddamn head, and I, I just don't want to remember it. And yet, my goddamn brain decides to fucking remem- remind me of it again. Like, for God's sake, I I, I want to forget, but I literally can't. There's a point that I cannot sleep because of it. <sighs> Not to mention my goddamn diseases that doesn't that doesn't want to stop. Like my left ear. Is apparently blocked by something, or is apparently blocked by something. There's a point that it hurts so goddamn much. I don't even know why the fuck does it get blocked like that. And、uh, my throat just get just keeps on getting worse, along with my goddamn headache just keeping on getting worse. <sighs> And I guess. I guess my、uh, my severe high body temperature is, is I, has I guess been resolved by something. So I guess that's pretty much one thing resolved. I think. <sighs> like what's even worse is that I literally can't sleep. Like I literally try to lay on lay on the left or lay on the right, I still just get those goddamn flashbacks and memory and like like so. What the hell am I supposed to do if literally like、uh, I can't sleep thanks to that? And it literally goes to the point that ugh. Like I know it's even worse. Is that people just like you know what's even worse? Is that whatever I'm just trying to forget, it just keeps coming back, and something or someone just have to literally show up, and literally destroy any kind of effort that I've ever made to move on. Whether it's by playing video games, listening to some songs, or whatsoever, it just keeps on coming back, which is complete bullshit, to be honest. And what's even worse is that my disease is just keeping on getting worse by the time, and it's not even like the middle of the goddamn semester, and I'm already, I'm already suffering. I'm literally gonna be staying home for a very long time, away from college or, or anything. Like, <coughs> oh, fuck. Like Jesus Christ. Like, do, does it really have to? Like, do I really have to get? But then, like for other people, it won't be surprising because it's literally, it's literally the aftermath effect of being hated too much on the goddamn social media. And honestly, I just keep on regretting on being on social media in the first place. I keep on wanting to quit more than anything else. And honestly, I still want to quit. I can't stay in here. Like I know it's just a goddamn、uh, 
it's just a bunch of shitty hate comments and whatsoever, but this is just ain't easy on me. This just ain't easy on me to forget or to move on from. And the worst part is, people just keep in on justifying it. Like, like if this is justifiable, then does that make everything that is fucked up justifiable? Or we just love to literally change any and all kinds of goddamn goddamn decency and whatsoever related stuff on our own goddamn will like for, like for god's sake I want the suffering to end already and apparently it won't end unless I quit the social media for good I know I would be suffering more because I would be losing a lot of friends. And I've been sometimes thinking of making an alt on Discord. But, um. I don't think I can handle another goddamn thing. Especially when a lot of people have got used to my main account. And, um. <clears throat> No, that, but I'll be losing a lot, so, I don't know, I don't know, but hopefully, but I, I just want that suffering to end, and, uh, and to be able to move on with my goddamn life, and at this point, I can't even look at the fighting games anymore. I can't look at any more fighting game related stuff again, thanks to all that. <sighs> but then again, <sighs> what can we do? I guess I truly have lost everything. And who knows, I might be also losing my life, thanks to the goddamn results that would probably come sooner or later, or before Ramadan. Which is literally gonna be the worst goddamn case scenario that's probably gonna happen again. Oh well. I just wish that none of that had to happen. But then again, what can I do? It's all... It's all dying. It's all just keeping on dying. I just... I, like, honest, like, I didn't really care about internet fame. But I, the only thing that I needed... Like, the only things that I've ever needed in my goddamn life, on this goddamn... On the goddamn social media was a place that I can feel and act like myself in without getting brutally fucking judged at, even for the smallest goddamn things. And I just wanted some decent goddamn friends and maybe a goddamn girlfriend to literally, to literally ease, ease things up on me. For a basic, I just wanted a place where I can feel safe. I didn't care about internet fame or clout or subs or any of that. But I just wanted some goddamn decent people. I just wanted some goddamn, some goddamn companionship. And you know. Some motherfucking goddamn warm human interaction that would make me able to move on like literally a month forward at least. Just like how I just like what I used to have way back in the day on on Twitter roleplay communities. Like it used to be such a fun experience 
Especially with that suck. Especially with that. With that one Sakura Kazugano account. Like. They really. They really gave me a warmth and a friendship that I have never thought I would ever have. Which is truly. Which is truly what saved me during that time. And I don't know what I could have done without them. Just for me later on to literally ditch them. That that one goddamn friend, along with a lot of other friends, who they used to be really, really so goddamn supportive, and really the ones who have truly, truly stood by my side. Now it's all empty. I have none of those supportive friends. I only have very few who are trying to fill up their place. And I appreciate the effort, but I just want I want those people that I've ditched to be back. Like I really can't I really can't go on any more than any more than that. Like I've lost it. I've really lost it. And I'm pretty sure that uh, they probably hate me by now. And uh, they definitely got to her. Inevitably got their revenge for sure. Like I've got karma whooping my ass all over. And um, this was a very hard lesson. That I do not ditch you, those who are actually supportive. I literally replace them with people who have never been any supportive and been just acting this way to hide on the fact that they hated you and they wanted you to kill yourself. <clears throat> Honestly, I wish that this wasn't true. And yet, it is. Because that's a real life, you know? You know, I used to think that real life and internet were, were two goddamn different sides. But however, I don't think they are any different anymore. I fucking, I fucking hate myself for that. In fact, I really fucking hate myself for every single friend that I have ever ditched back in the day. And, um, I just, I just wish that, um, things did not have to go that way. And yet it did. And yet it did anyways. I fucking hate my life. And I would really love for it to get fixed one day. If it ever has a fix. <sighs> oh well. I guess I have been old. <sighs> yeah. And honestly, social media was nothing but a disease that I should have gotten rid of long ago. <clears throat> Even way before discovering any and all of what I have discovered. Even way before I am. Honestly, I'm just tired of this life that I've built up for myself. Like, I've got almost everything I wanted. But at what cost? At what cost? Honestly, I should have known better than everything and anything that's ever happened. And honestly, I just want to go back in time and literally like, relive all of that while fixing my own choice. Like, 
I just, <coughs> I just, I just cannot, I just cannot take this anymore. I really cannot take this anymore. Like, I'm already, like, completely destroyed. And I just can't trust anyone or anything. I don't want to even be out from my circle. I'm going to isolate myself. And let's just hope for the fucking best. All of that could have been completely worth it. If it didn't have to be this way. And yet it is. It is what it is now. I've lost it. Completely lost it. And maybe... Maybe it would have been better if I just died earlier. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna have to go now. <sighs>